So, are you on? Alright, what's up, y'all? New in November 2009. Today's November 4th. And what we're going to do today is we are going to talk about safe sex. That's what we're going to do. But we're going to get into some more interesting topics about it other than what you normally hear about. Now, we're going to talk about, first of all, now let's say you're chilling, right? So, you know, here's you, um, you know, you're hanging out, um, you know, you're having a good time. You know, you, you big willy, you got the, the big pockets, right? The big, big pockets, deep pockets, money for days. Now, you chill in, you go to the club, so then you meet a chick, right? And then here she is right here, you know? So here she is, we'll throw on some Grace Piper hair like this, and boom. So, you know, she's smiling like everything's groovy, right? So you're feeling everything's groovy too. So, boom, you're hanging out now you decide unfortunately for you not to use safe sex right so next thing you know boom wah wah that goes like little kid you know what I'm saying you got like the little curly Grace Piper hair too but you know it's either a boy or a girl regardless you know it's a 50 percent chance now here you go now the problem is here that first of all you, I mean you're just hoping she's like a cool person she's nice all that stuff but the problem is here that these are now going to get diminished, right? So now we're going to go get our eraser for your big willy pockets, and we're going to do this, you know what I'm saying? So now your pockets look, you know, more like this. It's like half of the big willy. So now you're chilling, and that's cool, right? Except the problem is what happens when the next man comes along, right? And he's chilling, you know, he's sinister there like this. And here comes the next man, and he likes your girl too. You know what I'm saying? You like your girl, but he likes your girl. So it doesn't really matter. I mean, either she could still be with you, or maybe she's not still with you. But here comes this dude. All of a sudden, he likes your girl. And regardless of whether you're with this girl or not, you still have that care with her. So now he likes her. He's like, hey, you know, um, she's looking good. Right, so then boom, he wants to hook up with her, and then let's say just the same way she didn't use safe sex with you, she didn't use safe sex with him. So, next thing you know, boom, here we go, we got another one looking like her and him instead of her and you. Right now, that's all cool and all that, but you notice this dude over here, he knows he doesn't have any pockets, right. What if he's just like a bum? What if he's one of these bum dudes that's at the club and it's like, you know, he, he dressed up a little bit, he bought a new shirt this week, and he happens to be able to pull a check and she happens to fall for the okie doke, right? Now what happens is that there are two kids now. She's taking care of this kid and she's taking care of this kid. Him, he's taking care of nothing because he can't take care of anything because, look, he got no pockets. So meanwhile, you know what that means? That means that your pockets... We're going to come over here, and we're going to get our eraser out again. Boom. The, even your regular willy pockets now are becoming little willy pockets. Now you have the little willy pockets because the problem is all that child support and yada yada that you're handing out this way, which is supposed to go this way, actually goes two ways. Now, see what I'm saying? Because all you know is you're giving her money and you don't know where the money's going. So the money's now going to take care of your kid and his kid because he's not taking care of Jack because he doesn't have any pockets because he's a bum. Now, this is the problem. This is the problem with not using safe sex. It's like all of a sudden, you're paying for everybody's kids. This is not good. Now, to illustrate, we have the first year of baby cost calculator. And, you know, these new regulations are coming up. Uh, so I will mention I have nothing to do with Baby Center uh, you know, this is not a sponsored nothing. I just like this chart because it's very useful. Now, first year baby cost calculator. Right off the bat, as soon as you load it up, your baby's first year will cost 10 G's. Now, think about what you would like to do with 10 G's and then think about not being able to do that because your baby's first year will cost 10 G's. Now, why would a baby cost 10 G's, you're wondering? Well, let's figure it out. Boom. Ongoing costs, child care. I won't be paying for regular child care. Maybe you won't. 
All right. If you're not paying for regular child, boom, your baby's first year cost automatically drops down to fifty-five fifty. But that means you're going to be taking care of your own kid, which isn't going to happen. So, help me estimate. Boom, back up to ten thousand. Now, help me estimate. I'll use a daycare center. Seven hundred and sixty-eight dollars a month. Seven sixty-eight. See what I'm saying? That's higher than your cable bill. So. Okay, let's see. Home daycare. That's a little better. Moderate. 568. Who knows what home daycare means because they also have nanny. Boom. 2600 a month. Boom. 2600 a month. You're done. Look, all of a sudden the baby jumps up to 21 G's. 21 G's. You know what I'm saying? All because you decided that you weren't going to use safe sex. 21 G's. This is 21 thousand dollars for this one and then this dude puts another twenty one thousand so that's why your pockets are minus forty two thousand dollars because you're taking care of your girls kids with you and your girls kids with bums crib mattress baby monitor you know what I'm saying crib mattress I guess, you know, it seems to me like a mattress should come with a crib, but I guess that it doesn't. I guess it's an extra 140 if you want your kid to be sleeping in comfort. Baby monitor. 40 bucks, 60 bucks, whatever. Feeding. Bottles and nipples, 60 bucks. High chair, 100. Utensils, 13. Plates and bowls, 10. Cups, and, you, see, you see where this is going, right? Now, breastfeeding. Here's where they get you on the back end with the breastfeeding. See, the breastfeeding was zero dollars up at the top, right? But now all of a sudden it's one seventy seven. And that's without the electric breast pump. Two fifty. Now look, even a manual breast pump is thirty bucks. You know, I now I don't know how much work that is for the chick to manually pump, but you know, she's gonna be like, What's up with the electricity? And boom, that's two fifty out your pocket. Milk storage bags, breast pads, extra breast shields, ice packs, nursing bras, nursing pillow, infant bathtub. You see all this stuff, right? Child proofing supplies, blah, 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 blah. Even going the El Cheapo rate, your baby's first year will cost you forty nine fourteen. So that's the least it's gonna cost you is five here and five here, hoping that she doesn't kick out another one, right? And then all of a sudden you multiply this again. So you're at least going minus 10 G's, and that's every single year. So this is why we want to rock with some safe sex. Besides the fact that it'll keep you alive a little longer, what it's going to do for you is it's going to keep you chilling a little longer because your pockets will be like this instead of like this. And that's how we want to be living, is large, instead of not large. New November, 2009. No glove, no love. Don't forget your Jimmy hats. Pace.